His life of crime began when he pulled a Grand Theft Auto when he was only 10 years old. Tonight, with your help, his fast lane life on the run will come to a screeching halt. Cops say Terrence Washington earns his ends robbing banks. It's a good thing for him, because he'd starve if he tried to make his living at his other chosen profession, being a rapper. We found copies of Washington's lyrics, and you can hear for yourself. His hip-hop skills are suspect. I hate going through a day without learning a thing, or going through this life without earning a thing. Cops say everything Washington earned, he stole escaping the law by sprinting warp speed through the woods like some marathoning thug or burning stolen rubber. But in July of 1998, cops finally caught up to the slippery Washington in Conway, Arkansas. Washington didn't stay in jail long. Cops say he made a deal with a trustee, then jetted out an open back door. We gotta eat, and no one lives no more. It's every man for himself. April 4th, 2002, the suburbs of St. Louis. Hi, um, there's a guy outside my window. He's shining a flashlight in some parked cars. I don't know, it looks kind of suspicious. Maybe you should send someone over. And when cops arrived, they wouldn't have to search long for Washington. We spotted him up uh, with my uh, mag light, and he just honks and waves at us. That was just, uh, it was pretty bold. But before cops could catch up to Washington, he high killed it. Police canines lost Washington's scent in the woods. Now, an amateur thief would have said, hey, I got away, I'm calling it a night. But Washington's got the mentality of a true thief. His goal that night was to steal an SUV. And he wasn't leaving the neighborhood without one, cops or no cops. Unfortunately, cops say Washington picked the wrong SUV to rip off. Isn't that your SUV? You just can't believe it's your own car, you know? Of all cars and all vehicles in the neighborhood, he could steal you and think it's the one that has the two guys that's trying to hunt him down. About five hours later, a frightened woman got an unexpected jolt with her morning coffee. I I'm worried he might, he might come inside. She'd seen Washington in her garage. Minutes later, Kirkwood, Missouri police had him in their sights. K-9, he's running, he's running! Please, K-9, stop or I'll shut the door! Stop fighting the dog! Get this dog off! Stop fighting my dog! Get down on the ground, all the way down, all the way down! Show me your hands, don't move, don't... Washington was sent back to Louisiana to face his original bank robbery charges. At the Tangipahoa jail, he met a dude named Dan Robertson, who was being held on burglary and weapons charges. Them bars are old. I can get us a hacksaw. You in? Show me the way out. I'm in. They would talk, stay up all night and talk. They would, uh, they would sing rap music together. They came pretty close and pretty tight. Somehow, Washington got a hacksaw smuggled into the jail. And on July 13, 2003, cops say he and Robertson broke out. Driving in the fast lane, the cops will come and get me. Maybe I'm just dreaming, hoping, believing the money will give me clarity. And on September 25th, 2003, Washington's rap lyrics became a reality when Maryland state troopers caught up to him outside of Baltimore. The way I would describe the feeling that takes place during a chase is just an absolute adrenaline rush. I can't believe that this SUV 
not only just hit me, but now he's backing up and he's gonna try to do it again. Four players ran my vehicle twice. Then Washington ratcheted things up another notch to get away. Cops say he crossed the highway and began driving against traffic. As Maryland state troopers continued their pursuit, Washington skidded to a stop and once again fled into a wooded area. He hasn't been seen since. I'm trying to live. Give it the best that I could give it. Success would be exquisite, and I ain't tripping all in due time. There's nothing more hungry than a criminal mind.